Hello, beautiful ones. Welcome to my page, and this is Serenity Star. I'm coming to you today with a read, so let's get into it. So you're trying to make a decision. Someone's trying to make a decision on which pursuer that they want. Your, heads are in the, your head is in the clouds. You have so many choices. You are the king of pinnacles in reverse. I'm getting a sense of, if this makes sense, your head is on top of the clouds. That's what I'm getting from spirit. You have two men that are pursuing you. The Knight of Cups in reverse. He's coming to you with big offers. You know, a lot of love telling you things that you want to hear, things that he can provide for you. But it's in reverse. It's in reverse. So, you may have some game going on right here. But you have your options. With the Seven of Cups. You have many options, actually. Then you have the King of Swords. This is your mental man. Can be like an engineer or a lawyer, very brainy in his head, sharp tongue. So this could be an air sign. But he's on top of his game. He may not say the right things. May not be as emotional as this Knight of Cups, but the Knight of Cups is in reverse. So he knows how to get to your emotions, he knows how to make you feel, but he comes up empty a lot. He may he may try, he'll tell you something, and he may come up empty. I mean, he's trying to do the right thing, but he got a lot of game. I will go with the King of Swords. You know, with a little talking, just telling him what you like. If he says something that just cuts you a little too deep, you don't have to talk to him. And you're the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. So you are nurturing. You probably nurture a little bit too much. You probably give a little bit too much. But you're going to have to kind of set back a little. Because you do have options. With the seven, seven of Cups. Make a decision between these two pursuers. This King, uh, I'm sorry, Knight of Cups. He feels good to you. He sounds good to you. But can he bring to the table what he is promising you that he can show you? 
you know, he's on it. He's going to take you on trips or want to take you on trips. He's going to talk about trips. He's going to lay it out thick. But there's going to be a lot of missed opportunities. Spirit is like, go with him. He's more stable. He has found, you know, his foundation is more stable. So, it looks like you're having some fun for this love month. So, I just wanted to pull a few more cards. With the six of wands in reverse, this knight of cups in reverse. Like I say, he's going to talk about trips and travel and taking you places, but he's making a lot of promises that he can't keep. This knight of swords, this air sign, he's consistent. With this five of swords, I'm telling you, these these swords they real mental. Now he knows what to do. He's he he's firm. This king of swords, he's he's gonna show up when this knight of cup doesn't, because he's made the mistakes. He's he's over promised. He's over delivered. So he's going to make a lot of mistakes. But this King of Swords, he's going to be right there. You see the, just say, you know, in the background, you see the Knight of Cups, he's giving up. If he's not giving up, he, you're not paying attention to him much longer anymore. The, the King of Swords, that's your man. And the three of pentacles. Like, both of them are working to get closer to you. They're working to be around you. They both want you. But this knight of cups, he's not as mature as this king of swords. The knight of cups, he's not as mature. This king of swords, he's the king. He knows what he's doing. They both working towards you. And this, this knight of swords, he, he wearing on you. He putting in the work. He putting in the long hours. He's a mature man. He's the king. So weigh your options, because you definitely have them. Somebody's going to have some fun on Valentine's. So, beautiful ones. If you like this read, please like, subscribe, and share. And until next time, love and light.